Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys can hear me very well. I am on my way to work. Um, I'm supposed to be there at 2.45 for a huddle, which I know I'm not going to make it. So, I'll just get filled in whenever I get there. But, um, today I'm coming to you guys with another crazy life uh, movie. Another crazy life with, it's a movie to me. It's another crazy life video for you guys. Um, this video will be about uh, my school situation. Um, I'm only going to talk about this situation because it has to do with my next video. So that is the only reason why I am talking about this video. And if you guys hear weird noise, I'm not even going to lie. I don't know where it's coming from. So yeah. Um, what else you say? Yeah, it's going to lead up to my next video. My next video is going to talk about all of the deaths that I had in my family and how I dealt with them. But this video is going to talk about my education and the real story behind that and what really happened. Okay, you guys know that I am majoring in um, family studies with a minor in psychology. Um, I had like four or five, sem no, I had like three semesters to go um, and I would have been done. But not to use my uncle as an excuse, but basically when he was alive, I would, he was basically my motivation. Um, him and my dad was basically my motivation to actually finish school. Um, when he passed away and my dad got sick, it's just like my motivation went out the window. So I was passing school up until we got to, after midterms, I didn't give no fucks, part of my English, but I didn't give none at all. Um, and I don't regret it because now I have to live with what goes on from here. Um, <clears throat> so basically, um, I had to deal with my family issues. Then plus, I had to deal with um, some other stuff that was going on in my life at that time. Um, that I, I don't want to speak on, but my grades kind of went downhill from there, so I just didn't care about keeping up with my grades at that point in time, so I just didn't, and I'm sorry if it's shaking a lot, but I just didn't care enough about my grades to the point to where I could say I, I didn't want to pull them up. Because I was going through so much stuff and I'm like, why even keep trying it? And I hate that I had that mindset because now I'm stuck in that predicament to where um, I have to actually pay, pay out of college because pay out of pocket for school because I lost my scholarship. Um, and the thing about it is I told 127 of you guys and I told my dad, and that's it. I haven't told anyone else about this situation. But if they perhaps run up on my video, then that's the only way they'll find out. Because I have the type of family, if you tell them something, then they try to fix it for you. And I'm the type of person to where as if I get myself in a predicament or in a situation that tends to... Um, that tends to um, have a bad after effect, then I have to find a solution or a way to uh, fix it. And I want to do that. I don't want no one else to do that for me. I want to do that. And I feel like if I do that myself, then I have less to, uh, then it, 
me fixing issues for myself is what got me to this point. Um, fixing issues for myself and not depending on other people to fix that issue for me. Um, I know sometimes you get to a situation where you're like, man, I'm tired of trying to do everything on my own. Um, sometimes you need that help, but at this moment, I don't think I need that help. And, yeah, so I just don't ask for it. Or I don't need anyone else's opinion unless I ask for it. But I feel like I got myself in this situation. I can get myself out of it. So that's the reason why I haven't told anyone in my family lately. Do I regret not telling them? No. Um, would I ever tell them when I get myself out of the situation? No. But when I have kids and have my own family and my kids start struggling in school, then I know how to help them and how to change my change their environment. So that's the way, that's how I look at things. Um, so yeah, um, right now I really don't, <laughs> right now it's not funny, but right at this moment I don't have a solution. The only thing I know is to pick up where I left off mainly get in contact with my advisor and tell her, look, we're going to start from here and I'm going to finish it out, no problem. Because right now, I probably got twelve classes to do and I'll be done. But the thing about it is, for those twelve classes, it's like probably $150 a piece, not including books and all that. So, um, and decals, and, um, getting my card back, I mean, it's going to be a lot. Um, and I hate it because I got to start from the bottom, well, not from the bottom, but I got to start from a lower GPA because when I, um, failed majority of my class because I did fail them all and that's what I don't understand because I only failed like two of them and I was taking like six classes and I only failed two of them but um I was working with the 3.8 anyways but when I failed them classes it dropped down to a 3.1 I believe 3.1 plus some numbers behind it so um it, it won't be hard for me to get back where I was. Um, just the scholarship I had, I can't get it back until I get back up to that level. And I hate it because um, that scholarship paid my school off. And plus, it was well, paying the semester off that I attend. And plus, it was paying for my books. And then I just had to pay for the decal and all the accessory stuff. Which was great. Um, so I messed up on that part. And I regret it. But then again I don't. Because I put myself in this situation. Um, and like I told you guys. I don't have a solution right now. The only solution I have for myself. Is to actually get back in and finish it. Um. Now that I have this nighttime job, I know I can do classes in the daytime and work at night. Um, Cause classes at my school don't start till nine, and they'll still give me enough uh, sleep. So we're gonna work it out. Um, I do regret going to a college, uh, a community college before. I went straight to. Um, before I went straight to, uh, uh -oh. I do hate the fact that I went to a community college and I didn't attend, I didn't go straight into a university. When I got out of high school, I should have went straight to a university because I feel like some of the classes I take now are kind of repetitive. They goes together. So that's what I should have did when I got straight out of high school is 
went to the university I go to now. Um, and plus, I have a minor, so that kind of puts me behind with graduating with my minor. So I'm thinking about just dropping my minor and go straight into um, majoring, which is family studies, which I could lead into um, psychology. I mean, lead into a social worker. That's my plan. So, yeah, guys, I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, my day is my days are crazy. I don't know. Oh, I hope this man don't hit my truck. Girl. I don't know you guys. I'm just I'm just tired, honestly. Um I'm ready to go to work, get these little nine, ten hours over with. And just be done with today. To be honest with you guys. Um, sorry for the awkward silence. And the thing is, I'm going to leave it in there. I'm not going to edit none of these. I'm just going to throw it right up. Um, The first two videos of this series, I edited. It, but then I'm like, I'm going to stop editing these series. And I'm just going to throw these videos up for you guys. And hope you guys enjoy them. Because when I take time to edit them... I realize if I edit the way they, the, if I edit the way um, my phone want me to, to cut majority of like the freeze moments and all that out, then my videos won't be number one or two minutes long and then majority of me telling you guys about the situation is deleted. So I'm like, I'm not editing none of this. The only thing that I probably add in is like words and all and, and probably... I'm trying to re, re redo my intro because I want it to be upbeat and stuff. I had one with music on it. I might just keep that one because it's just a clip of the music, and I know it won't and it won't it won't get copyrighted. Um, I also want to go into uh, I also want to go into. Uh, reaction videos but I'm not sure if I want to do that yet because uh, the person that I was collabing with told me um, when it comes to reaction videos you have to use a lot of time and all of that stuff and right now I can tell you time and patience is not on my side so I think I'm just going to push that back until I find like another, until I start back pushing out a lot of videos at once. And I decided to like record on a Saturday, Sunday, and then I'm just gonna release them throughout the week. Um, my schedule is getting ready to change, so my only off day will be Fridays and Saturdays, which I won't do nothing because it's so, it's, I work so many hours during the week to the point to where. Um, I don't want to do nothing when I'm out. And plus, like, I get paid every two weeks. So when I do have days off, I don't be, I don't get to spend the money. So it's like, it's just sitting there waiting to be spent. And I can't spend it because I be so sleepy and tired. Um, I work from 3 to midnight or 2.45 to midnight. It just depends on if everybody that I work with shows up. Um. And if everybody I work with leaves on time. Um, so basically I'm getting ready to wrap this video for you guys. Um, I will probably come back on my break and do and talk to you guys a little more about something else. Or just a little um, 15 minute video because I got 15 minutes. So I probably just do like a 5 or 6 minute video for you guys. Um, just random videos. Because I have a 15 minute break. So yeah. 
Um, so I'm going to wrap this video up. I hope I see you guys in my next video. Um, don't forget, before you leave this video, you guys, help your girl out. Um, tell everybody you know to come to subscribe to my channel. Also, be sure to like my channel, my videos. You can share my videos and my channel. Um, also, comment below of other videos you guys would like to see. Because in November, I'm starting a new series all about budgeting. Um, and that's great because I'm, I'm, all, I'm on this budgeting kit. So that's a great uh, time for me to do it. Um, well, it's going to be called Budgeting Journey. So, yeah. Um, what else, what else, what else? Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy my video today. Um, my next video will be released, uh, Friday. Today is Wednesday, if I have not told you guys that. My next, you, you guys will probably see my next video early Friday morning or real, real early Thursday morning. It just depends on my time schedule. And right now, it's looking like it's going to be Friday. Uh, so, I hope you guys have a great day, a great evening, a great week. Do not let anyone destroy your day or your mood. Go out and be a blessing to someone else. And I'll see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a video. Because YouTube do not... Um, send out notification for my videos I don't think like they used to so yeah see you guys in my next video peace